Check out the PV insulation tester from Unity. It's the UT503 PV. It has insulation resistance measurement, Bluetooth, auto detect ACDC, photovoltaic measurements, and has hold feature with uh, some audible visual alarms. Let's check it out. All right, here's the specs. It has ranges, 125 volts, 250 volts, 500 volts, 1,000 volts, from uh, 0.125 mega ohms up to 4,000 mega ohms. Okay, all of voltage measurements from 5 to 1,000 volts DC or 5 to 600 volts AC. And look at this, it's CE registered. All right, it's another one of those hard, soft cases, I call them. Very nice case from Unity. Let's check it out. Okay, we got a zippered pocket. I like that so the things don't all fall out. So we got the manuals over there. Whoa, check out the probe. That is cool. Oh, look. So you don't have to take your hands away. You can just hit the little button right there when you're testing. That is sweet. There we go. That is nice. I like that. Okay, we got some big crocodile um, jaws. Um, oh, we got some normal probes with the protective tips and our test leads. Oh, those are filled nice and soft too. So what else we got? Um, oh, so for PV, those for your solar panel and USB to USB-C. Looks like a strap and lots of batteries. We got two, four, six batteries and these nice soft foam inserts. Well, what's that? I wonder if that's to keep the batteries like that. I don't know. I wonder if it needs all those or those are spares. Okay, so here we are with the CE IP54 on the back. It looks like two screws for the batteries. And okay, here's our inputs. There's that nice probe input. Here's a, a probe for earth ground, okay. And can I do this one-handed? Oh, there we go. Got to figure out how to open it first. Okay, there we are. Whoa, that's nice. Okay, nice little guide here. Tell you how to take measurements. And there's the meter. So we'll have to put some batteries in it. And just testing to make sure. All right, captured screws. And yes, all the batteries. The unit sits inside the top and let's turn it on. Wow, nice big display. I'll do some testing on this in my long video format.